Hey guys, welcome back to Modern Nomads. It's your boy Prophet. I'm Elias. It's your boy AJ. We're back for Walking Dead season six, episode eleven. Uh, yeah, last episode, what's that? I forgot his name. What's that dude's name again? Um, that Rick and uh, Daryl saved. Yeah. Uh, that, is that what people call him? Yeah. That's no, he had a name, but he said you can also call him Jesus. All right, cool, cool, cool. I'm just gonna call him Jesus. Right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Jesus. Uh, I don't know. I think he's gonna warn them about something. There's probably like his his group or former group are probably like Yo. it could be related to Negan. One thing I'm gonna say is that was wild. Him just coming to Rick's room. Yeah, <laughs> that was crazy. Looking forward to this episode. I say, I said we get straight into it. If you're new, make sure to like, subscribe. Let's go. Kind of bizarre seeing this place empty again. Still can't stop thinking about Maggie having a pup. She's definitely gonna have some sort of miscarriage. I can just see it. Don't say that. I'm starting a new shift, the watch post on Baggerly. Is that so? I already talked to Eugene. He wants to help out more. Said he'd take over my patrol with you. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How about that? Yo, what's going on here? I think I you know, read it. Yo. Have I heard it? Some it might be up for your girl. I think you just read that wrong. I think it was just he was a bit awkward because Eugene is come. He's gonna do a shit to you, Eugene. <laughs> yeah, well, that yeah. throws that out the window. Hey, you still here? The timing isn't a coincidence, AJ. Hey, hey, we get the trellises and we can start going vertically. Double R yielded tomatoes per square foot. You can only keep stretching our rations so far. Still haven't seen a single blood. Babe, it'll grow. Can't believe you disrespected these guys, man. Saying Rick and Michonne is a bear ship. <laughs> you were tripping, man. What the hell are you doing in our house? Carl on business, man. Waiting for your mom and dad to get dressed. Carl. <laughs> <laughs> uh. It's okay. Yo, everyone funding. <laughs> Let's talk. So how'd you get out? One guard can't cover two exits or third floor windows. Knots untie and locks get picked. Entry comes from order, right? I checked out your arsenal. I haven't seen anything like that in a long time. You're well equipped, but your provisions are low. Very low for the amount of people you have. Look, we got off to a bad start, but we're on the same side, the living side. I'm from a place that's a lot like this one. Part of my job is searching out other settlements to trade with. I took your truck because my community needs things. I'm Ben. He works for Negan. Yep. Do you have food? That are our competing uh, community. We grow everything from tomatoes to sorghum. Tell us why we should believe you. If we take a car, I can take you back home in a day. And you can all see for yourselves who we are and what we have to offer. You're looking for more settlements. You mean you're already trading with other groups? Wow. Your world's about to get a whole lot bigger. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yo. What? That's fire, man. The world building in Walking Dead? <laughs> Shit. They, they stretched it out for six years. Well, six. Now, a lot of the stuff we've been dealing with yeah. for like the past couple of seasons was like internal. Yeah. Especially with the uh, disease and stuff like that. And finding new set settlements when, you went to, um, when they went to Alexandria. Now they're finally settled. Because let's be honest, the prison was not really a place no, for no, it. No, was it, it For them, they thought it was permanent, yeah, but that shit was temporary, man. Oh. This, this place could actually be permanent. But we'll see what happens. You sure? No. So when is baby gonna grow up, man? This could be the start of everything. This is this is different. It's cool. Get your stuff. Gabriel can take care of Judith while we're gone. Father Gabriel, did you pray today, Prophet? Someone's gonna stay back. Get this place safe. Kid with a messed up face probably wouldn't make the best first impression anyway. I ask you a question. When you were uh Pouring the bisquick. He trying to make pancakes. <laughs> uh, yes. Something that we talked about, yeah. Yeah. Why? Given the precarious state of affairs on any given Sunday, I am damn near floored that you or anyone else would have the cojones to make a call like that. We're trying to build something. Me and her. All of us. I feel like Abraham is afraid to build foundations anywhere. Correct. What's going on? We gotta crash your head. Looks like it just happened. It's one of ours. This is a trick. It won't end well for you. My people are in trouble. They, we don't have a lot of fighters. I know how it looks, but I'll play it out. Can I borrow a gun? No. Got tracks right here. 
super suspicious online. What in or what? I don't even know this thing firecrackers in a trash can. You don't. We'll get your people. You're staying here with one of us. One, bro? Don't even with one person. You hear me whistle? Shoot him. I will. They left him with Maggie. Oh, my God. She know. can hesitate, but I doubt she's going to hesitate. Bro, she has a kid in her stomach, man. I just hope she doesn't get hit. She ain't hesitating for shit, bro. Come on out. I'm not going to hurt you. Friends of Jesus. We're here to get you out. There more of you? Two more. They ran ahead. Come on. We're with Jesus. Let's go. I, I can't go with you. I'm looking for my friend. Come on, last go. Come on. <laughs> You're lucky, bro. Lights turned on. Seems like Jesus is kind of like there, Glenn. You're a doctor? Yeah, that's right. You have any prenatal vitamins in there? For you? I was an obstetrician before, and I most definitely owe you. I'd say you two just hit the jackpot. Let's go. But we know she ain't going to work out like that, man. Let's be honest. AJ, the doom and gloomer. Okay, when it happens, don't be shocked, because I told you. Remember that. I ain't gonna lie, that sounds like a zombie getting squished. The storm must have passed through. We're stuck. No worries. We're here. Where are they living? That's us. That's the hilltop. The hilltop. Stop right there. Whoa. You gonna make us? Jesus, what the hell is this? Open the gates, Cal. Freddy's hurt. Sorry about these guys. They get antsy standing up there all day doing nothing. They give up the weapons. Then we'll open the gates. You come down here and get them. Gentlemen. Look, we vouch for these people. They saved us out there. Lower the spears. Now look, I'm not taking any chances. Tell your guy Gregory to come out here. No. Don't you see what just happened? I'm letting you keep your guns. Look, we ran out of ammo months ago. I like you people. I trust you. Trust us. It's like some medieval town. <laughs> what? I feel like they have a lot of uh, food, but not enough. Uh... Well, it seems like they got like some sort of farmer setup type mm. shit, bro. Chickens. I'm surprised these people lasted this long. It's really good to have like alliances with other people, like, having different spots. There was a materials yard for a power company nearby. That's how we put up the walls. A lot of people came from a FEMA camp. Trailers came with them. How do people find out about this place? That's called Barrington House. Family that owned it. Gave it to the state in the 30s. The state turned into a living history museum. Every elementary school for 50 miles used to come here for field trips. The place was running a long time before the modern world built up around it. I think people came here because they figured it would keep running after the modern world broke down. Jesus, you're back. Oh, he meant that like <laughs> literally like his name. This is Gregory. He keeps the trains running on time around here. I'm the boss. Well, I'm Rick. We have a community. Why don't you all go get cleaned up? We're fine. Jesus will show you where you can get washed up. It's hard to keep this place clean. Yeah. Sure. You talk to him. Why? I shouldn't. <laughs> then you gotta start doing these things. Like the politician. <laughs> How long do you think Rick and Michonne been hugging bum, please? <laughs> you ever think about it? Settling down. You think you should settle? Why is this low-key building up to an Abraham pack? I think we're just getting some development. I feel like we got the Gregory. Though. Natalie, right? Maggie. That's pretty close. Not really. <laughs> she calls him like she sees him. Come in, let's chat. I came to this place once before uh, when it was a museum. It was some chamber of commerce thing. Loved that painting. Mm -hmm. I never figured it'd be mine. Here it is. Jesus told me your group saved Dr. Carson. Obviously, Doctor's a rare commodity today, so I want to thank you for bringing ours back. My husband saved him. I'll be sure to thank him, too. This place, what you have here, has been here since the start? That's right. And how, how is it? How have you survived here? Hey, looking at how. I'm good at this, and I don't get hung up on the details. <laughs> this guy talking shit right now. We came here hoping to talk trade. Do you have enough here for that? You see what I have here. You see what I built. You don't keep people fed. It comes apart. Nice. Let's speak the common tongue here. You don't have shit. I'm happy to help. I'm a nice guy. But we can't just give things away for free. Since you can't offer much, I'll let you people work here for their share. You'd be a welcome addition to the community. Smart, beautiful woman. Getting back to that common tongue, I tell you, I can make it worth your while. Let me stop you right there. Listen, honey. Stop coming on to me with calling me honey. You don't have any ammunition. 
You need things. We need things. Facts. Some some open this guy, man. Something that we don't know about. We can help each other. We're doing fine. Are you? We want to generate trade. Gregory does. But ammo isn't something we urgently need. Well, how's that? The walls hold. We just brought in more medicine. Gregory wants the best deal possible. We need food. We came all this way. We're gonna get it. I will talk to him. You give me a few days. You better give them food, man. They literally saved some of their lives. We can. Yeah. Rick Deep Down just wants to take, just <laughs> kill them all and get them food, man. Yeah. What's wrong? They're back. They're back. I'm telling you, the real people are here, bro. Oh, there's, yeah. a, there's a reason why they sur survived, bro. They need people no. to protect them. These guys are probably Negan's crew. What happened to everybody else? They're dead. Negan? Yeah. Oh. They still have Craig. He said they keep him alive. Return him to us. If I deliver a message to you. So tell me. Sorry. Oh! oh. Get up of me! I have to! <laughs> Wow, Sasha's on his mind. That's crazy. Damn, let's go. Let's go, Daryl. Hey, Yo, this has to turn off, man. Anybody who tries to stop me is killing my brother. Drop this. This Viking ass nigga, man. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Demon time, Rick, bro. Yeah, I feel bad for that guy, though. Fuck him, bro. His brother's hostage, yeah, bro. It shit, is what it is. I do feel shit. bad for him. We don't give a shit, man. Demon time. What? Yeah, what? <laughs> What's wrong with these niggas, man? You killed him! No we shit, you were trying to kill us. Ah, oh, fuck off. Stupid bitch, what the fuck you think this is? Stop don't touch her man, what the fuck? I don't think I will. Everyone, this is over. Let's not pretend he was anything more than a coward who attacked us. Thank you, Jesus, man. Bars. These guys are retarded. They have like sub IQ. Like, they literally seen him stab their leader. Ridic as, as Rick <laughs> just said bro. right now. What? You need to know things aren't as simple as they might seem. Just give me some time. That's all you need to tell them the, the, the full story of what's going on right now. Hey man, you good? Yeah. I'm better than all right. That's tough for your girl, Rosita. At least she's single now for you, AJ. You can actually... What is it? Drop the necklace. Yeah, bro, it's over for Rosita. It's symbolism, bro. Come on. Dr. Carson was able to patch Gregory up. How's he... He got lucky. Locked out, man. Oh, Missed yeah. out. We heard the name Negan. A while back, Daryl and Abraham had a run-in with his men. Who is he? Egan's the head of a group of people he calls the Saviors. Saviors? As soon as the walls were built, Saviors showed up. They met with Gregory on behalf of their boss. He made a lot of demands, even more threats. And they killed one of us, Rory. He was 16 years old. Damn. Said we needed to understand right off the bat. Half of everything. Plies, our crops, our livestock. It goes to the Saviors. Wow. And what do you get in return? Nothing. They don't attack. They don't kill us. Well, how many people does Negan have? We don't know. We've seen groups as big as 20. Jeez. Oh, they show up, they kill a kid, and you give them half of everything? <laughs> These dicks just got a good story. Boogeyman, he ain't shit. Why do you know? A month ago, we took these guys out PDQ, left them in pieces and puddles. If we go get your man back, kill Negan, take out his boys, will you hook us up? We want food, medicine, and one of them cows. Hmm, tell them there. Confrontation's never been something we've had trouble with. Take it to Gregory. So it tells me this might be one of the worst decisions that they make. Yeah, I agree with you. I'm sorry, bro. They think it's a small group. I'm but sorry, it's not, bro. It's probably something very well organized. I don't know, bro. And if they've been eating good from this settlement, there's probably another 10 settlements. That be this is the trade. It's going to cost us something. 100%. That's a foreshadowing, bro. It will, though. You're fighting a whole other group, bro. It's going to cost us lives. Jesus told you about our offer. He did. Makes you think you can do what we haven't done. We've handled people like Negan. We can get your man back. I don't know if Craig's worth the trouble. Frankly, I don't know if I want him back in our gene pool. My dad used to tell me <laughs> forgiveness takes more strength than anger. That reminds me of you, Prophet. I'm not going to lie. You give us supplies. We'll save Craig and take care of Negan and the saviors. I'm sorry. I find this whole conversation pretty funny. I mean, you balk when I propose that your people work for our supplies. But now, isn't that exactly what's happening here? True. I had leverage and I used it. 
We need food. You have it. We're willing to work for it. Then I get supplies for your people. Good. I'll talk to Jesus and he'll make the arrangements. Half. Excuse me? Half of what you have. Half? Yes. I saw what happened out there. Negan's expecting more supplies from this place. And more and more. And if it keeps going like that pretty soon, you won't have anything left. <laughs> what She's happens good. then? Grill him. Thank you, my Mikey bros. Even Negan didn't get this much up front. What? Jesus said you've been taking supplies to Negan since the beginning. We're gonna get Craig back. Only way to get Craig back is to bring them Gregory's head. We're gonna get Craig back. We need to know what you know about Negan's compound. We need your help. We need you to come. Yeah, I'm getting a bad feeling, man. This whole episode, I've been getting a bad feeling for future events. It's like, you know when like people are smiling? So it's too happy go lucky, man. Like, you hear me? There's too much shit going on, bro. What's wrong with smiling, bro? Sometimes you just gotta smile, AJ. I'm, like, I'm just gonna keep it cool for now. I'm not gonna say, but like... I'm 99% sure, like, at least three people in this episode are going to die soon. I feel like that that hilltop place is not going to survive until the end of the season. Yeah, that yeah. place is getting taken hilltop out. Hilltop getting cooked up, bro. It's not and the survivors are just going to join uh, Alexandria, I think. Yeah. So oh, that's what's going to happen. Yeah. Now, the, uh, we'll probably deal with uh, Negan's group of the saviors pretty well, but I feel like... Negan is going to be he, he's I've heard his name like I've heard his name around you know when you hear a name of from a show and he's a villain yeah. you know he's going to cause damage bro yeah I love I, I, I love I, this I had no clue about the governor I never heard about the governor but I heard about this guy's name before yeah. so you already know he's going to he's going to yeah. cook if a character is that like I when you mention his, like people, the people when people keep mentioning this guy's name, yeah, yeah. this guy had to do some wild. Well, shit. When you bro. hear the governor's name, it doesn't really is like governor. Huh? Nah, put some. Negan respect. Yeah, the governor was the governor was hype. Ah, he's okay. Man. Put some respect on the fine, governor. Man. Negan's gonna be next level. That's why I'm feeling. I don't mean, yeah. they have a, we'll see. Like he has like Negan has one group that they just wiped out was the same size as the governor's group. To be fair, to the be governor honest, the, the governor done a lot of damage. To be fair, yeah, because he was let go. No, but, but he, what he done, he, contri- he contributed to the show. Oh, 100%. As a you know what I mean? Oh, especially season five, or was it four, second half of season? Season five, four. four. He was yeah. really good. The real ending half. of, what should have been the real ending of season three, uh, season five, I episode eight. I still enjoyed it. I like, I, ha- I like they, they gave him a bit more. I, only is, I don't want to digress. I'm going to digress after this, when I make my point. Yeah, go ahead. Um, they, they developed his character really well in season four. And I, I'm, I'm hoping they do the same for Negan. They introduce his group and we slowly get to know what their group is doing. Yeah, yeah. And hopefully we just kind of, we don't get to the final boss too quick. Yeah. The final that. boss? I think this might be the final boss. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, that he's the final boss. Yeah. I feel, I feel like the final boss will be um, not human. It could oh, be yeah. like, there probably won't be a final boss. The ending will be like Everyone the cure dead. and everything. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Everyone dead more like No, the, I feel like the ending will be the, the the final episode will be like the, the cure was finally made. Maybe like one character survives, maybe something like Maggie or something. One person or two people, you get me? Daryl, more like it. How about uh, <laughs> Abraham and Sasha? Bro I was thinking Yo. about her and he was about to, like near death decision. experience. Mm. He's thinking about her and uh, Rosie Annis' girl's uh, necklace was on the ground. <laughs> My yeah. Annis. Anna AJ, same thing. But damn, bro, I don't know. It's looking crazy. Rosita and Eugene. Chip. <laughs> nah, <laughs> hell nah, bro. That, it's, bro, we're watching The Walking Dead. This is no, like, romance shit, bro. Extra <laughs> shit, bro. I don't give a shit about all that shit. I'm, I'm going to be real with you. The only shit, the only thing when it comes to, two, like, rom- the romance side is Maggie and Glenn. Every, anything else, bro, miss me with that They've shit. They've been couples so long. I even forgot when they got hopped yeah. up. If it, if it ain't Glenn and Maggie, I don't want to hear it. That's all I'm saying. But I'm looking forward to the next couple of episodes. Do you have any thoughts? Other thoughts or? Oh, that's enough. That's enough. Yeah. yeah. Looking forward to the next couple of episodes. I feel like it, this season is gonna end with a huge bang. No, a huge bang, bro. Really? It's gonna be crazy, man, bro. Uh, they, it, it's literally episode twelve, and there's four episodes left, and they're gonna confront Negan. <laughs> I, I think like this might be the best finale of this whole show. The finale episodes in this season are going to be crazy. I'm looking forward to it. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you're new. Indeed. Yeah, we're a modern nomads and we're out.